Welcome to 10 Magical Places to Visit in Albania. Number 1. Tirana. When traveling to Albania, it is nearly impossible to avoid going to the country's capital city, Tirana. Tirana is not only the largest city in Albania but also the easiest place to begin your adventure from. In addition to these benefits, the city is a fascinating and exciting destination to dive into the culture and history of the country. Skanderbeg Square is an excellent place to begin, as it is located smack dab in the middle of the city and is home to the remarkable National History Museum. This museum may be recognized by the enormous mosaic that adorns its front face. Other notable historical sites in the city center include the Etihem Bay Mosque, which was constructed in the 18th century, and Bunkit II, which is one of two Cold War bunkers in Tirana that have been skillfully converted into art and history museums. In addition, the city is filled with cafes, pubs, and restaurants, which combine to produce a vibrant nighttime scene that is not only enjoyable but also accessible to a wide range of budgets. Number 2. Barat. Barat. A town in Albania, is widely regarded as one of the country's top tourist sites due, in large part, to the extraordinary Ottoman-style buildings that dot the landscape there. The picturesque architecture of Barat has led to the town being dubbed the City of a Thousand Windows, and the UNESCO World Heritage List recognizes the city as a site of cultural significance due to its more than a thousand years of history. In addition to taking in the breathtaking views, Tourists will adore roaming through the ruins of Barat Castle and making their way down to the exquisite Gorka Bridge. The Church of the Holy Trinity, which dates back to the 13th century, the final ruins of the Red Mosque, and the relics housed within the Onufri National Iconographic Museum are three other impressive historical sites located in and near Barat. Number 3. Saranda. Saranda, a popular tourist destination and some of Albania's most beautiful beaches may be found in close proximity to one another near the very southern tip of the country's extensive coastline. Every traveler will be able to find something they are interested in doing in Saranda as a result of the city's fantastic beaches, pulsating nightlife, and fascinating historical attractions. The two key beaches that really come to life during the summer are Mango Beach and Saranda Beach. Nevertheless, the beachfront at Polbarda Beach is also quite gorgeous, Mango Beach and Saranda Beach both have a lot to offer. The hilltop ruins of Lakursi Castle are at the top of the list of attractions due to the fact that they offer some of the best views of the sunset in the area. Visitors visiting Saranda have the opportunity to spend the day in Greece on the well-known island of Corfu, which is accessible through a quick ferry ride. Greece is another alternative for daytrippers. Number 4. Albanian Riviera Although Saranda may be the most well-known beach destination on Albania's coast, the term Albanian Riviera refers to a collection of many other smaller towns and beach resorts throughout Albania as a whole. The term region refers, more specifically, to the stretch of shoreline on the Ionian Sea that begins from Saranda and extends all the way north until it reaches Lagara National Park. Aside from Saranda, Jermi is most likely the most well-known beach town along the Albanian Riviera because of its vibrant nightlife and the several music events that it plays host to. Nonetheless, there are many quieter towns along the Albanian Riviera, such as Amira, Borsh, Palace, and Vuno, where you may easily spend a few days relaxing by the beach. Some examples of these places include Number 5. Duras as does is the most important port city in Albania, it is simple to assume that it is not deserving of the holiday time you have worked so hard to achieve. Nonetheless, Dur warrants a deeper study as it is packed with significant historical landmarks and is home to the beaches that are located the closest to Tirana, the nation's capital. The Des Amphitheatre, which is the largest of its sort in the Balkans, is without a doubt the most prominent attraction in the city. Nonetheless, the Venetian Tower of Duz and the Archaeological Museum of Duz are also highly intriguing. When it comes to beaches, the Plazi Igalamit beachfront is located to the south, while the beaches on the Bay of Lousy are located to the north and are known for their relative peace and quiet. Number 6. Lake Ored and Podredek. The city of Ored, which is located on the Albanian side of Lake Ored, may be more recognized as a popular destination in the neighboring country of North Macedonia but the Albanian side of the lake is just as worth visiting. If you want to spend some time sailing around Lake Ored while you are in Albania, the city of Pogredek, which is the main Albanian destination on the lake, 
is the logical choice for you to make. But Pogradec also has a few things to offer, such as its extensive seashore and the spectacular views that can be had from the remnants of its castle perched on top of the hill. Visit the city in June for the Puppet Theatre Festival for an experience that is a little bit out of the ordinary. The festival's success has led to the creation of similar events in other Balkan countries. Number 7. Kruja. The little village of Kruja is an absolute must-see for anyone who is serious about immersing themselves in the history and culture of Albania. Kruja, which can be found not far to the north of Tirana, is home to a number of the most notable museums in Albania and has strong connections to the Albanian national hero George Kastriotti Skanderbeg. After all, it was from Kruja Castle that Skanderbeg successfully resisted the Ottomans for decades, an achievement that established him as a revered figure in the country. It should come as no surprise, then, that the Skanderbeg Museum is now housed in the castle of the town and is devoted to the guy. When you're up at the castle, don't forget to check out the Ethnographic Museum of Kruja. It's located in a lovely Ottoman home and shows tourists what life was like for wealthy families during that era. Number 8. Lagara National Park As the stunning nature of Lagara National Park demonstrates, the majority of Albania's mountains are not located in the northern part of the nation. If you head north of the Albanian Riviera and keep following the shore, you will eventually arrive at this mountainous national park with its mesmerizing views of the Albanian coastline. In spite of this, the Lagara Pass, a mountain pass that has an elevation of 1027 meters and is home to some of the most beautiful portions of road in all of Albania, is probably the park's best known feature. Even if the road did not take you to any magnificent overlooks, it would be well worth the effort to drive through the Lagara Pass. Hiking and seeing the local fauna, which may include chamois, golden eagles, and European wildcats, are two of the other things you can do to pass the time at Lagara National Park, which is full of things to do. Number 9. Vlore. Vlore is another city in Albania that offers a varied selection of activities, making it an excellent choice for a vacation destination due to its all-around appeal. The well-known vacation destination is situated on the southern coast of Albania and offers visitors an abundance of beaches, a vibrant nightlife, and more than its fair share of fascinating historical treasures. Plazii Re and Plazii Vjetar are two of the island's beaches. The former features a longer stretch of sand while the latter is located closer to the island's center. It is not difficult to find places to go out for the night in Vlor, but the cold water area near Uji i Ftod has been particularly popular over the past several years. Both the Independence Proclamation Building and the ruins of Kanina Castle are significant historical sites. The former served as the location of Albania's Proclamation of Independence in 1912, and the latter is located nearby. Number 10. Apollonia. The ancient ruins of Apollonia are without question one of the most spectacular historical sites in all of Albania. Albania is home to a wide variety of fascinating historical sites. The Apollonia Archaeological Park can be found close to the little city of Fierce slightly inland from the central coast. The park is home to the ruins of the ancient Greek and Roman city of Apollonia, which was established approximately 600 BCE. Archaeologists continue to find additional ruins and artifacts at the Apollonia site, which is now a UNESCO World Heritage Site. At Apollonia, notable landmarks include the theater, the House of Mosaics, and the old facade of the monument to Aganafites. In addition, the museum at the archaeological site is located within an equally exceptional and historic monastery building, 